and I'm so excited to show you guys what I got from Best Buy. Okay, I'm so excited. So, if you know me, you know I love coffee. I love dark coffee. I love sugar coffee. I love all kinds of coffee. I love, love, love coffee. I love the smell of coffee. If there's a coffee candle, I will buy it because I love this. I just love it. I love it. I love everything about it. It makes me happy. Like, it's supposed to be in a good mood. And, yeah, so I literally go to Starbucks all the time. I will wake my ass up early go outside in the cold drive like two miles away just to get me starbucks like i freaking love coffee so i decided why don't i just like get myself a freaking like espresso maker you know it would save me time and it would save me so much money so because literally every time i go to starbucks i get like a venti and it always comes out to like seven dollars you know what i mean so i was like you know what and i do go quite a lot so i said i'm gonna get me an espresso maker and i am so excited to use it this is like the best thing ever for me it's funny like how when you get old like you get excited about freaking espresso makers like you know not anything else but like things like this and i'm just so excited okay so i'm gonna show you guys what it looks like it's still in the box um my house is a mess um but i was i just couldn't wait to show you guys oh. Here it is. This is it, guys. Look at it. Oh my god, I'm so excited to use it. So it's an espresso and cup cappuccino maker, and I'm so freaking excited. And I just cannot wait. So now I just need to buy the actual coffee. So I still have no idea where I'm gonna put it, but I'm going to make room for it. Best believe I'm going to make room for it. I'm thinking of putting it right here. Okay, guys, my house is a mess. Okay, do not judge me. Okay, that's it. It's just a mess right now. Mentally, I have just been going through it, but I don't want to talk about that. Um, but anyways, my house is a mess. But I'm gonna show you guys where I think I'm going to put it. Oh no, that's a bad idea. There's no plug here. Okay, never mind. I'm not gonna put it there. I think I'm going to put it over here. Okay, so that's our microwave clearly this is our water jug which i'm really annoyed with because we like never even go get water anymore so i think i'm just gonna move that our microwave is going because we ordered a air fryer today too from um best buy but it doesn't get here for another 10 days it gets here on the 26th so that's obviously not here today but i think we're gonna go ahead and sell our microwave if you guys want a microwave, we have one for sale. So I'm gonna move the microwave and I think that's where our air fryer is gonna go. And then right there I have like my spices or whatever and I, al I always keep my kettle. Actually this goes over here. Um, So I'm gonna move this, probably keep this here cause I do like tea as well. And then my spices and then over here, I'm telling you guys I have a mess. But over here I have my toaster and then my, um, what is it? My, not vacuum. Why was I going to say vacuum? My blender. <laughs> my blender. And then we have like fruit and stuff there. So what I'm thinking, so what I'm thinking is I'm going to move my fruits. Okay. <laughs> so I have my fruits right there. And then, excuse my messy dishes that I'm about to wash. And then over here I have this baby next to the fridge um the baby stuff so i'm thinking i'm going to move the fruit here and put my espresso maker right there because obviously it needs a plug but i'm going to put that baby stuff away because rosita does not use bottles ever and yeah so that's pretty much like we pretty much just put like random things there like because she doesn't use it so i just put like other cups there and it's just honestly a waste of space and yeah, so I'm just gonna go ahead and move that and I'm going to get down and dirty in my kitchen to make it nice and clean. So then I'll show you guys how I fix everything up when I'm all done cleaning. And I'm so excited for my espresso maker. So yeah, I will see you guys in a few. One hour later. Right guys, so we had went to Sprouts and that's why I had a bunch of stuff on the table. 
But I cleaned the kitchen and it looks so nice and clean. Except for the dishes I have to put away, but don't mind that. Don't mind these little stains right here. But I ended up moving the frutero here. And then I just like switched some stuff around and it looks so beautiful. And I cannot wait to use her tomorrow morning. Her name is Delonghi. <laughs> I don't know if that's like <laughs> And yeah, so I'm so excited. It looks so cute. And then I ended up moving our water jug because it was bothering me so much. Um, but yeah, so to, when our air fryer comes, we're going to replace our microwave with air fryer. And we're probably going to sell it. Love it. She is pretty. So we're gonna eat some spaghetti and meatballs today. So I found this spaghetti at Sprouts because right now I am eating gluten-free and no dairy at all. So this is a gluten-free spaghetti made out of black beans, which is why it's black. I've never tried it, but I'm really excited. And then this, I'm gonna be using the Beyond Meatballs. Um, so last time I made meatballs with the Beyond um beef but i this one like this is cool because they're already made um so you don't have to do anything like but cook them so yeah that's what i'm using so i definitely recommend if you are hungry want to cook a, a quick dinner and you are a busy parent like us definitely get something that's prepared just so you could throw it on the grill prepared doesn't necessarily mean unhealthy this is very healthy they are plant-based meatballs and yeah so these are really, really good, and I'm excited. Okay, so while the water is boiling for the spaghetti, I'm going to go ahead and season the meatballs real fast. More. Babe, how many meatballs do you want? Uh, make the whole thing. Well, you tomorrow. All right, cool. Okay, so it says they're Italian style, but I still want to add more, so I'm going to add some Italian seasoning. I'm just gonna, oh yeah, shower them with it. And then I'm gonna add a little salt. And some pepper. And then I'm gonna go in with some garlic powder. Just so that they don't stick because this pan isn't really a non-stick pan. And then I'm going to show you guys how you know when your oil is ready in a little bit. And meanwhile, I'm going to put the pasta in the, in the pot of water. So when you see all those little bubbles, that's when it's time to put the pasta in. So gluten-free pasta cooks a lot faster than regular pasta so you want to make sure you don't overcook it <laughs> that didn't turn the freaking stove on and i'm like why is the oil not getting hot <laughs> so i forgot to turn the stove on that's why so this is the marinara sauce that i'm going to use again we are doing something quick today so this is really healthy though. This is only 70 calories. I'm shook. Ver, ver, ver. So this, so this is how you know the oil is ready. You're gonna wanna lift your pan, and if you see that it slides super easily, that's how you know that it's ready for whatever you're going to cook. Or you can, you can grab a little bit of water and do that. That's how you know it's ready also. So now I'm gonna put the pasta in. And just drop it in there. Cool. So I got my meatballs, my pan is hot. You wanna hear that sizzle. So if it's not sizzling with anything you cook, if it doesn't sizzle, then your pan is way too cold. These meat 
fall smell good already. You smell them? No, it's spaghetti. <laughs> some Elmo. The meatballs are almost ready. They look pretty good. So I'm just turning them like all angles pretty much. And you just got to keep turning them so that they cook evenly. And the spaghetti, the noodles are ready. So this is what they look like. You guys, I swear they are so good. I swear you guys. Okay, so I put it on low just so that it doesn't like jump at me. So now I'm actually going to take this spoon because this one might break up my meatballs. And I'm just going to stir them all up. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and put my spaghetti in. So I'm going to grab these now. I'm going to give them a little shake. Just put them in there. So the spaghetti is ready. I'm just going to wait for Leo to eat because we always eat together. But I'm going to show you guys right now. It looks so good. This is how the pasta looks. The finished result of the spaghetti and meatballs. The vegan spaghetti and meatballs. Can't wait to try it. And then I just sprinkled some vegan mozzarella on it. And yeah. Eat okay? I'm getting one now. <laughs> you know this ain't real vegan food, right? Yes, it is. Is the mozzarella sauce vegan? Yes. No marinara sauce. Oh, yeah. It said vegan on the bottle. Yeah. Can I put a piece of? But try the meatball. <laughs> It tastes fire. The meatball right now, take a bite of it. Hey guys, so we're on our way to Target. We're gonna go to Walmart and then Leo said, or should we go to Target? Tar Target, <laughs> Target, <laughs> or should we go to Target? And I was like, and then he was like, <laughs> and then we were like, let's go. <laughs> so now we're on our way to Target. And I'm gonna get some coffee stuff. And I don't know whatever you know it's like that one meme it says target you don't, you don't go to target telling target what you need target tells you what you need so i'll figure out what else i need when i'm at target what are you getting why do you want to come to target target tells me what i want <laughs> this is like Apparently. this is relationship goals right here what more can i ask for 
My husband likes to come to Target. I have an espresso machine. <laughs> what more could I ask for? <laughs> we got an air fryer on the way. An air fryer on the way. We got a boy and a girl. Life is good. <laughs> we ain't got no jobs. <laughs> we don't got shit to do. <laughs> Here, get some toys, me. Some toys, boy. <laughs> what, what you talking about, toys? You didn't eat your meatball. <laughs> Who's crying? <laughs> I heard you crying. How much is it? Twenty bucks. Damn. That shit used to be five bottles. I need clothes. You need clothes? Yeah. So I'm gonna go to the clothes because sometimes they have some good deals. Oh well. Do you think we need another baby carrier? I need one because I don't want the one you have. Why? You don't like it? No. Okay. If not, I'll find it on. If I don't find it here, I'll find it on. Oh, Opera. look, like he's done. Because I want to go hiking. I want to go walk around the desert. Oh, hey guys, so I'm literally editing this video right now and. I guess I did not record an outro, um, but I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for all the support that you guys gave me on my YouTube channel. Even though I'm not as consistent as I should be, you guys are always watching, liking, and subscribing. And even though there's only a few hundred of us, I love each and every one of you so much from the bottom of my heart. So thank you guys so much for all the love, and I cannot wait to see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.